Welcome to my study notebook. Today we are going to solve a problem of a normal distribution. And uh, here you can see a normal bell curve uh, distribution. And it says that the gra graph represents a normal distribution if approximately 95% of the data depicted by the shaded region, then what is the mean and the standard deviation of the distribution? So if we uh, think that mu is the mean and sigma is the standard deviation and we recall the rule of the 68, 95 and 99.7 percent then we will remember that for a normal distribution curve if this is the M then 68 percent of the data lies within uh, one standard deviation that is uh, M plus sigma M minus sigma or we can use mu also since we have uh, taken a mean as mu but this is the same whatever symbol you would like to use but for 95 percent uh, the distribution would be mean plus 2 sigma and mean minus 2 sigma so um, since it's a 95 percent of the data uh, what it essentially means is that um, m minus 2 sigma or if you want to put uh, mu minus 2 sigma the same thing it's 300 and for the upper limit it's 700. So we have two unknown variables, uh, the mean and the standard deviation, and two equations. So by solving these two, we will be able to find our values. So I'm going to simply add these, and I'm going to find the mean, which is 500. So we have found the first answer, and for the second answer, we can solve either of the equation. So from 1, uh, we get 2 sigma equal to mu minus 300, and sigma equal to mu minus 300 divided by 2. So since mean is 500, it's 200 by 2 equal to 100. So in this case, uh, our mean and standard deviation would be 500 and 100. So in this case, the answer would be 1. So in order to uh, solve this problem, we actually have to know the rules of the a normal distribution and what it means uh, and if we know that we can easily use this formula to find out the mean and the standard deviation. Okay.